Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's McKendra. Today we are going to be doing our first Christmas look. I have a couple of a couple of them in mind and I'm super excited for them and I hope that you're super excited for it too. But first I wanted to show you, I went to Ulta today and I just wanted to do a haul of some Ulta things that I got. Nothing is sponsored obviously. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to show you a couple things that I had gotten. They are having a pretty big sale right now. Um, they had a couple things for like only like three bucks or two bucks, um, which was awesome. So a couple of things I got. I got a lot of these. Let me pull them all out really fast. I got the ColourPop um, Ultra Matte Lips. I got this one in the color La La Land. I got this one. It's kind of it's a lighter red, but it's called Chronos. 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 And then I got this brown, which is called Beeper. Cute. And then I also got Growing Pains, which is like a, a lighter version of that one that I just showed you, the brown. I also got some concealer because it was only $3.50 at, oh, that's not my concealer. The concealer I got, it's only $3.50. They were having, ColourPop was having a really big sale and I wanted to try it anyways, so I thought it would be really cool to just go ahead and get it. Um, so I got this one. It is the ColourPop No Filter Concealer. Hopefully this is my color because it was really hard to tell in the store. And then I also got, sorry I was like opening stuff and then I <laughs> also got the NYX um, Slip Tease in the color Red Queen. It's like, it looks like this. It's another um, liquid lipstick like all the other ColourPop ones that I got. And then I got this red eyeliner from ColourPop as well. Girl, I'm telling you, ColourPop was like popping right now and they had a bunch of stuff. So I got this. It's red. It's a red um, liquid liner. And then I've also got some red um, lip liner as well. Another thing I got from ColourPop, which was only four bucks, was this mascara. It's a red mascara. Um, I thought it would be really cool for some of the looks that I plan on doing for Christmas time. And then um, I just got some more eyeliner because the NYX Epic Ink Liner is like where it's at apparently. So there's that. And then I got some white NYX liner, liquid liner. And then I got this Essence um, White Eye Pencil. And last but not least, I got some NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Color Foundation. And I am in the color Buff. Hopefully, but we'll see. <laughs> so that's all that I got from Ulta. That was a pretty awesome deals, I would say. I would definitely go check out Ulta right now because the holidays are coming, so they're trying to get rid of a lot of stuff. Um, so that's a must, I think, that you guys should all do. Um, but yeah, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get right into this video. I'm not feeling the best. I haven't been feeling very well the past couple of days. And I've got Shane in the room laying down, so um, I'm just gonna be probably doing a voiceover for this look just because I just kind of want to play with makeup and I don't really want to go with anything and I've got him in the room listening so <laughs> all right um and let's just go ahead and get right into the look what is up you guys welcome back to my channel um so I already got my eyebrows done with my Revlon color stay creator and then this is the palette that I'm going to be using the morphe palette and the concealer. Concealer I use to just um, prime my eyes and to cut out my eyebrow to fix it up I would say actually. <laughs> so I'm using this to fix it all up. And now I'm just going in with my Maybelline Fit Me and um, the pressed powder and I'm going to be putting this on my eye to set my eyes. Okay, so this is the first shade that I'm going in with. It's like a taupey brown. I'm putting this in the, directly in the crease and buffing it out all over the lid, the upper lid, um, because this is the color that is going to be my transition color. And then I'm going in with this darker brown and I'm putting this in the crease as well just to deepen it up a little bit. And now I'm just going to be going in with this really deep dark brown um, 
underneath all of the shades that I've used in the crease. I'm just trying to deepen it up a little bit more for when I cut the crease, then you could see it, and, but it's not shown as much. Now I'm going to be going in with my ColourPop concealer that I showed you in the beginning of the video that I got at Ulta. Um, I'm cutting the crease with this. This um, concealer it works really, really well, but it dries down really fast. So I had to keep reapplying it, but it worked beautifully. And now I'm going in with my Jawbreaker palette, and I'm taking the color Virgin. Um, and I'm placing this on where I cut the crease just to set the, the crease. And now I'm going in with my NYX epic ink liner and yes I did do this off camera because it was extremely hard and difficult but now I'm just going in and I'm touching it up a little bit and then I'm gonna be going back in with that con same concealer and I'm cleaning up some edges Okay, so now this is one of the really hard parts. This is me actually creating the light bulbs of the lights that I'm creating. Um, I use the same eyeliner and I'm just putting little stick figures <laughs> and then I'm going in with the NYX white ink liner and I'm just making the little bulbs for, for the lights. Now this is when I'm going in with the color. I'm going in with this yellow color from the Jawbreaker palette and then I'm going in with the red in the upper corner. Then I'm going in with this blue, and I'm also going in with the Jeffree Star and Morphe palette, taking that green, and then the Morphe X James Charles, and taking the orange in the top upper row. And I'm still using my NYX Epic Ink Liner to create a wing. Um, I actually went over one of the bulbs and I had to go back and fix it later on, but I really wanted there to be a wing because I wanted there to be more of a oomph to my look, if you will. And now I'm going in with this NYX foundation that I showed you in the beginning, the Can't Stop, Won't Stop. And this actually applied really, really nicely. It was a really good match to my skin tone. I absolutely loved it, but my sponge absorbed it so much that I had to keep pumping and getting all of that product out as more than I usually would need. And now I'm using the same concealer from ColourPop that I, set, that I cut my crease with, and I'm going to be concealing my face. Now I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Press Powder with my sponge and I'm just going to be push pressing this powder underneath my eyes to set my under eyes. And then I'm going to take a brush, I took a brush and I set the rest of my face. And then I'm taking my Tarte Bronzer and I'm bronzing up my face as well as this Wet n Wild highlighter. And I'm just highlighting my face. I highlighted my cheekbones, my nose, my forehead, the inner corners of my eye, and my eyebrows. And that was me trying to pick a color because I couldn't pick a color to do my lips with this look. Because I didn't want to do red. Red was just way over the top. And I'm going to use it with other looks. So I went with this pink, which I really, really liked with this look. It went really well. It was like a pinky nude. And then I just popped on some lashes and added some mascara and this is the finished look. It turned out really, really good. I am obsessed with it. I loved it. Um, and I'm so happy for more looks to come in the future. That is it for today's video, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, I love this look. I never was so patient with a look before and it turned out really, really well. I'm actually really happy with it. So I hope that you guys like my, my first Christmas look and if you guys want to see some more, um, then leave a like and a comment and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.